What's up guys, Sila here, and we're on the Mr. Pandaria beta again, and there's been an interesting change on the latest beta build. So as you can see, I'm on a level 1 gnome called Wuzroob, and he's got a couple of achievements. He's got Icy Mammoth and Barely Made It, which are mount achievements. I've also got a few achievements as well. So it looks as though they've introduced the mount band and account and achievement band and account system. So as you can see, I've got 118 mounts on a level 1. These are all the mounts that I'd have on my main character. So, yeah, it looks as though they're working on this now. It looks as though they're trying to work out how they're going to be introducing it. Now, I don't know if you'll have all the mounts copy over from your main character to an alt, or whether it's just bugged at the moment and they've, they've not implemented it properly, or I don't know what's going on with it. But this will be an interesting change, especially for people who are looking to start a new character for Mop and are like, well, I've got blah amount of achievement points and mounts, and I don't really want to give all them up because I worked hard for them. Now you don't really need to give them up, because you'll have them already. On your, your new character, you'll have a high majority of them anyway. It depends how they implement it, they might only do sort of achievement based mounts, so it would only have the ICC mount, the Battle Bear, the Icy Mammoth, like things like that. But, I don't know, we'll see. So, as you can see I've got all the, the achievements as well. Now the achievements are a little bit bugged and don't show properly, I've not really got 3k on my main, but yeah, so as you can see this is my main character and I've got all the achievements, uh, all the mounts I'd normally have, and they were the same mounts that I had on the level 1. So if you log into a horde character now, you'll notice I get a few achievements saying I've got some mounts, but I've not got as many mounts. At the moment, the only mounts I've got are the like rare mounts and achievement mounts. I've not got any of the faction mounts. So mounts that would normally convert over, for example, a horse to a wolf. I've got none of them. I've not got like the Winter Spring Frost Saber, things like that. So that all of them have gone. So it's an interesting change. I don't I, I kind of like it. I like the fact that I'll be able to start a new character without the the penalties of losing everything on my main. It just depends how they go about implementing it. So let me know what you think about it below. Look out for more videos coming soon. Thanks for watching, guys. See ya.